Welcome back. 17 News is your local election headquarters. And this morning, Democratic Congressman T.J. Cox weighed in after the state Republican Party admitted to placing unofficial ballot boxes across several California counties. 17 Zaytan Wallace joining us now with the controversy and why this issue is impacting California's 21st Congressional District. Eitan. Jim, today I specifically asked the California GOP chairwoman if the party placed these unofficial boxes in Kern County. She did not answer the question directly. All she would say, the GOP placed them across the state, including in Fresno County. This is top Democratic state officials say these boxes are illegal. The GOP disputes that, and tonight Congressman Cox says they're hurting the integrity of the election. This is a massive, illegal, and coordinated effort to alter our voting procedures, and more importantly, to undermine Central Valley voters' faith in this election. Congressman T.J. Cox expressing frustration today over these unofficial ballot boxes placed across at least three counties in California, including Fresno, which accounts for part of Cox's 21st congressional district. The California Republican Party acknowledged placing the boxes in places where Republicans tend to congregate, like churches and gun stores. Cox says the Republicans must put an end to the practice. They're breaking the law in order to better their political position in November. And Attorney General Javier Becerra, a Democrat, appears to agree, saying what the California GOP is doing is illegal. Secretary of State Alex Padilla has ordered the GOP to remove the boxes by Thursday. But the GOP says that will not happen. They argue the boxes are very much legal and that no fraud is involved. As to the conspiracy theory that the Republican Party is somehow gathering these ballots and not delivering them, that is just dumb on its face. We have every interest and intention of delivering these ballots so that they will be counted, whoever's ballots they are. That's the point. We want the election to be free and fair. Frankly, this is just another example of California GOP. My opponent crying and whining after being out hustled and out organized in 2018. But the campaign of Cox's opponent, Republican former Congressman David Valadeo, says Valadeo had nothing to do with the boxes. And the California GOP chair blasted Cox, noting the Democratic majority legislature legalized ballot harvesting in California. This is TJ Cox's MO, um, and California Democrats' MO for that matter. Uh, they want ballot harvesting as long as they're the only ones doing it. That, as Cox wants Valadeo to officially rebuke the GOP for what took place. They've had every opportunity to disavow this, pro this, uh, this practice. They've been pointed out that this is illegal. So step up and do the right thing. How many ballots have been counted? The GOP said they do not have a number. Me meantime, as for whether they will be counted, well, we placed a call to the Fresno County Registrar's Office, but did not hear back by news time. In studio, Aton Wallace, 17 News.